grew up in Italy. I've been there since the age of two. My role currently with, with X29 is really to facilitate X29 in terms of uh, national coordination within Italy as a country. Planning a church really uh, is, is about going to the people where they are and engaging with them in a relevant way where they are. Some of the challenges in church planting relate to what you do before actually presenting the gospel. Uh, you have to know the lay of the land. You have to understand who you're up against. Of course, you're up against uh, mentality. You're up against uh, a whole baggage of tradition. Uh, between the North and the South there are differences, and in the South especially it's uh, strongly religious. Uh, whereas in the North it's disillusioned with religion generally, but secularization has come in. And so I think we need to go into a country like Italy, into the cities or into the towns or the villages, and uh, listen to people a lot more so that we can then present the gospel in a relevant way. There are vast segments of the country which are not reached with the gospel. Uh, the, the, the presence of Bible-believing churches is so small. So you're, you're up against a whole series of difficulties and the opportunities because of that are enormous. But above all, I think that people need to see genuine Christian living, gospel living, which is really lived out in the everyday life. That's going to make the difference. I believe strongly that Acts 29 is what Italy needs at this time in, uh, in history. Over the, uh, the coming months and years, by God's grace, we will be trying to, to, to see this DNA of church planting permeate through Christians in the country. And again, it's breaking out of the mold of, of tradition and we've always done it this way, therefore we'll do it that way. It's living the gospel and meeting the people where they are. So I feel very strongly that Acts 29 has a strategic part to play in that. Uh, just the, the, the actual challenging of believers and seeing new believers come to faith and then training them, forming them, equipping them, resourcing them, creating this coaching approach, which is so part of uh, Acts 29. So again, let me say, Acts 29 is what Italy needs right now.